so what is going on everybody welcome to your I guess eighth MongoDB tutorial in which I'm gonna show you how you can remove data from your MongoDB database and uh, well it should be actually just MongoDB because MongoDB kind of includes DB as well which stands for database so I probably don't need to say MongoDB database well anyways getting back to the tutorial what we have right here is pretty much nothing so I'm gonna say or actually let me just work with sublime only so right here if you see like uh, I say print hello potato and build it you see it says me hello potato and a buy as well well that's rude but anyways now what I'm gonna do is because this is our shell only so we have access to all that stuff which we were just making use of right there so I can say like use MDB and then I would say uh, like MDB or actually DB dot MDB dot insert and I'm gonna say that this is my object or actually let me just say that this is an object and right here I'm gonna create a var object and say it like uh, name mehul and then you know website code bam right and uh, then I want to create another object right so what I can do is I can actually insert multiple objects at a time and we'll just take a look at that how so I'm gonna do object to name as da 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 and actually <laughs> let's just keep it to da 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 because it has been recently news a lot so I want to change the website to facebook.com and if you know what I mean so now if I actually just change it to object 2 and if I want to insert multiple objects at a time what I'm gonna do is put them in the array and write object 1 and object 2 here we go now build this boy and see we have got the bulk write results instead of write results which we got earlier now what we can do instead of this thing is I could just actually show it as well db.mdb.show or pretty much find dot pretty and build it I can see that inside here we get a lot of duplicates because you see that we are running this code a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of times because we are kind of building it each and every time so this is not a kind of alternative for our Mongo shell so probably let's just work on Mongo shell only so I'm gonna say Mongo and uh, right here I'm gonna say use MDB and DB dot drop database enter and then I'm gonna say exit I'm gonna say Mongo I'm gonna say use MDB I'm gonna say now I'm gonna say uh, object one or let's just do a direct insertion now mdb dot insert to be like uh, name mehul uh, let's just keep it to that only for now and name da 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 right there and wait a minute db dot uh, let's just change it to names enter right there you can see and uh, oh I guess I missed a bracket right there this should be like that right so now if I write to uh, mdb dot find db dot mdb dot find hit enter well we got pretty much nothing actually because uh, this is names right so now you see that we got mayhol mayhol and da 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 because of probably this one right there so it wasn't expecting a second argument but anyways now actually in this tutorial what I wanted to do is show you how to remove the data right so if you want to remove a data you need to specify what sort of data you want to remove you don't want to remove wipe off your database in one command so I want to say db.names.remove 
and right here just like you insert you would pass in an argument which would contain an object which if matched would remove that particular record or the document or whatever the heck you want to say that and in this case let's say this is da 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 or let me just change it to mehul so that we can just get rid of two records right there so hit enter and you can see that in right result it returns me how many documents it has removed so now if i probably if i can adjust my mouse right there right there okay so if i say now db.mdb.find well well again the same mistake names dot find you can see that we are now only left with da 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 instead of all that crap which we had earlier well that is how pretty much you remove a database entry from mongo and there are kind of advanced way of doing that as well with regular expressions or with other advanced things like greater than matching anything else like your integer values greater than something or you know there are a hell lot of ways to do that but for this tutorial i'm just going to keep it real quick and simple so earlier or later on we're going to learn more about removing database the advanced removing database kind of it would be the title so that is all for this tutorial and if you liked it then don't forget to subscribe and thank you for watching i'll see you then in the next one